question 14. There's a book sale. Any three books for £14.50. And there you can see the young man Lee shopping for his books. But we're not really interested in the picture, so let's scroll down and see what we've actually got to do. So what we're really interested in is these three book prices. So we've got a £3.99 book, a £5.99 book and a £6.99 book. And as it says in the deal, any three books for £14.50. So how much did he save altogether compared to the full price of the books? Well, if he'd have paid full price, he would have had to have paid £3.99 plus £5.99 plus £6.99. So let's work out what the full price of the books would have cost him. So, 9 plus 9 plus 9 is 27. Put your 7 in, carry the 2. 9 plus 9 plus 9 again is 27, plus that 2 is 29. Put the 9 in, carry the 2. 3 plus 5 is 8, plus 6 is 14, plus that 2 is 16. So actually, it would have cost him £16.97. So that is the full price. But don't forget, he got them in a sale. So he actually only paid £14.50. So how much did he see? Well, we need to find the difference between £16.97 and £14.50. Anytime you find the difference between two numbers, you're basically doing a subtraction. Because whatever you get once you've done the subtraction is the difference. So if we work this out, we'll find how much you saved. So 7 take away 0 is 7. 9 take away 5 is 4. 6 take away 4 is 2. And 1 take away 1 is nothing. All we need to do is remember to put our decimal point in and the pound sign. So how much did he save altogether compared with the full price of the books? The answer is £2.40. Seven, and there's your answer.